Hi, I'm Dr. Jeff Langmaid with Research That Matters TV. Developing a healthy spine begins by understanding the three keys of strength, flexibility, and posture. Strength, flexibility, and improving your posture will go a long way towards reducing pain and improving your spine's function. Your spine is made up of bones or vertebra, and spinal discs separate each bone. If you look at someone from the side, you'll notice that the vertebra and discs create three distinct curves, the neck or cervical curve, mid-back, which is the thoracic spine, and low back or lumbar. But you may not realize that you begin your life with a single curve, and the others develop as you begin to crawl and walk as a child. As a baby, you have a C-shaped curve. This curve is perfect for optimizing growth and development in the womb. However, once you begin to lift up your head, your cervical or neck curve begins to develop. And not too far after that, your low back or lumbar curve forms as you start to take your first steps and walk upright. The development of these curves is critical to your posture as an adolescent and adult. Here are the three keys that support the development of healthy spinal curves. Number one, strength. Your core muscles, shoulders, and legs are essential to providing the proper support for your spine. Two, flexibility. Balancing your strength with flexibility is necessary to maintain a full range of motion and reduce your risk of injury. And finally, posture. Strength and flexibility will help place less stress on your back, but you should also have a focus on the dynamics of your posture and frequently changing positions throughout the day. Developing a healthy spine starts when we're young. The habits and actions we take today will affect our quality of life for years to come. Encouraging your children to stay active, keeping an eye on their posture, and promoting activities that strengthen their spine can all help support the development of great posture and a possible reduction in their likelihood of experiencing low back pain. My name is Dr. Jeff Langmaid, and I'll be back next week for another episode of Research That Matters TV.